We begin right now in Mississauga, Ontario. This is where police right now have a suspect in custody after an attempted assault at an area mosque. Now it happened during prayers earlier this morning, which left several people injured. So for the latest, let's go right now to the CPC's Lorenda Redekop. Lorenda, what can you tell us? Well, Michael, this would have been such a frightening time for people who were inside. We're told that there were around 20 people who were inside praying. It was during morning prayers. And so police say they got a call. It was before 7 a.m. And they say what happened is that a man entered this mosque behind me. He was brandishing an axe as well as bear spray. Now, the people inside, they thought it was pepper spray that was being sprayed around. And then some of the people who who were praying, they got up and they actually tackled the man and then held him until police could arrive. The National Council for Canadian Muslims is here. They've been supporting this community. They spoke to us outside here. And I asked how people from this community are doing. Obviously, uh, people are, are very shaken uh, and there's a lot of disbelief, a lot to process, uh, just the level of, you know, potential violence that could have been caused here today uh, if it wasn't for those very brave men who uh, who did what they did in, in, in everyone's kind of time of need. Now, thankfully, those injuries you mentioned, they're just minor injuries, really just from the effect of that bear spray. And in case people are wondering, bear spray is even more potent than pepper spray. And Nadia Hassan, she told us that even, you know, many hours later, the effects of that spray, they were still lingering in the air, but that people will be able to go back in for prayers and that this will remain open. Uh, some details that uh, police say they have arrested a man, a 24-year-old man from Mississauga. Still no word, though, on charges here.